Hi everybody, welcome back to Terra Firmacraft Season 5, Episode 77 with me, Sid. And last episode, we did some alchemy. We got the Alembics, we got the uh, Alchemical Furnace going, but we used up virtually every single bit of iron we've got. So this episode, we are out and about. I've already scanned that. Uh, I need... I've just let the night off. I have... Uh, well, I'll show you. I'm here. Uh, I've come basically by boat from here, so... I've really kind of headed out this way. We we know there's some reasonable bits and pieces around here. There was an iron question mark there. So we can kind of head this way if we wish. There's an iron question mark there. There was also this Ardite question mark there. Um, but I want to just kind of push myself this way a wee bit. Um, now, I need to get some fresh water because uh, my water skin is looking a little bit poor it's also winter we've got i think we've got plenty of ice now so getting out there and picking stuff up not going to be the uh, easiest of things but we should be able to have a little fertile around find some stuff do some things um and hopefully you know see some things now obviously i am running more risk i'm currently wearing a pair of pants and um and a uh, what are you? Oh yeah, pair of pants and uh, trousers, as we would actually call them. To be fair, uh, okay. And I'm going to grab these because these are useful. Um, these are source of orem. Those are. Uh, I think it's these. Is it these ones you get? Yeah, one of these has got precontatio in them. I'm fairly certain. Is it that one? No, Alianis and Tanabray. Uh, well, might as well have a little bit of this. It doesn't really matter, does it? Um, so yeah, while we're out of here, we're we're going to you know have a look around, fertile, if you will, and try and find some interesting stuff. Ultimately, I suspect we're not going to find a huge amount in terms of you know really amazing structures or anything because obviously you've got roguelike and that is kind of about it uh, but we will at least pick up some research points and uh, a few other bits I don't know whether I scanned that one you know you know when you sit there and think did I do that I know I did No, I didn't. Okay, that's fine then. Um, yeah, so... Really just fertling around, trying to find some iron. Um, a, a decent iron, you know, like a, a 35 quality iron or something in that kind of ballpark. And maybe some other useful bits and pieces while we're out here. Um, and try not to die, that's always a bonus as well. I've... I've come to realise over the years, <laughs> especially in this game. I mean, we've got the back command. I'm not getting the seeds now. We're obviously, we're, we're trying to improve the ones we've got, so I don't want vast quantities of of those. Uh, yeah, it's just me in the wilderness looking for some stuff, I think, and seeing... Seeing just how far the world goes. Well, we know how far the world goes. It's, it's virtually infinite. Uh, <laughs> but, uh, you know, metaphorically speaking and all. Now, if I... Not that bothered that I want to go swimming out to that. If I find any shards, any other useful stuff, I will be back as well. Because, you know, one of the things we're going to need is shards for the, the thorn craftiness of, you know... Thing. Uh, and again, I will mark on anything we find um, as we go, because you know it's, that's the way you find stuff, isn't it? There, no, nothing down there of interest. But um, yeah, I'm going to keep on trundling a bit, and uh, I'll be back within a sec. All right, two things we've discovered over here, apart from potential air shards um pull hematite here and 
ordinary quality gold here. Um, now we have a slight issue, <laughs> ever so slight issue, only a tiny, tiny little issue. Um, I didn't empty the uh, the hoofrator, the barrel, the back barrel, before we set off. Which means that most of my uh, things are full, which is a real pain in the bum. Because it means I'm out of here in new unexplored, un unexplored, unexplored terrain, looking for things to mine and take back, specifically iron. Now, f I have 15 quality iron hematite. I'm not going to worry about it. I'm going to mark it on the map and I'm going to leave it because it's only 15 quality. Um, I also took her fall, um, but that seems to have healed now. What did I say I needed? Uh, grain. Okay, go there then. Boop, 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 boop. We'll go with that one. Kniff. And plop, plop. Bit of that. Plop, plop. Bit of that. Plop, plop. Bit of that. And plop, plop. Bit of that. Now, the other thing that I'm I am in two minds about this now <clears throat> and there's a reason I'll explain my two mindedness once I've just picked up this food eaten this food and uh, chopped that off and popped it away and put it all back on my back so we'll mark this here for starters B this is surface iron 15 Now, uh, I don't think we, we've got gold, which is closer. Uh, this is surface gold 25. So I'm kind of reluctant to do it. So we have got, as we know, the back command, which is really handy if you inadvertently die, um, which obviously you're only ever going to inadvertently die. And no one's going to do well. So you're unlikely to deliberately kill yourself in this game. Uh, I will say that. I'll not say you, no one's going to uh, 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 deliberately die because obviously, unfortunately, the reality of the world is people do. Um, and I wouldn't want to offend anybody or, in fact, offend the memories of some of my friends who've, uh, over the years, felt that life was too, too, too much for them. Um, so, yeah, I'll, I'll shut up about that because that's getting a bit dark. Um... <clears throat> Where was I? Oh, what was I muttering about? Uh, apart from gold. Uh, yeah. So, I kind of have that, but there is also, I believe, the home command. And I, just out of curiosity, did a set home before I left. And I'm going to try it out before we head back. Now, banana tree. Uh, yeah, they, apparently they do make banana beer, which is... And I, and, uh, I was kind of semi-grossed out by that concept. Um, and then I went online and looked it up. And I'm, gonna, I'm definitely going to have to buy a bottle. I found it. I found some you can buy. So, you know, obviously, you, know, you, you can buy. I found some from a source that I can buy it. But... Um, I honestly don't know how good it's going to be. Um, it seems a little bit of an odd idea, but... Hmm. More gold. We'll go over there in a moment. Let's have a little look over this way. Um, so I'm going to try the back command, because the, one of the problems... So a problem I fi I'm, fi I'm finding increasingly recording Terra Firma Craft and some of my longer series is it is very time hungry yeah galana um it requires uh, where is that bear i can see him on the map where is it it can't be more than He's making me nervous. 
I mean, I'm, I'm tougher than I was, but I'm still not ready to start playing going head to head with a bear um, when I'm only wearing half my armour. Wow, there's another one over there. This is Bear Central. I see you, Bear. Get dead. Right, that's one bear down. Let's deal with the bears in the area. So, yeah, as I was saying, the, the one of the issues you tend to find with, with games like TFC is that they become time-intensive. Um, and, you know, that's entirely... Not sure whether that bears up the hill or down the hill. I'm, uh, I'm wary. I am wary. Do you know? You've got to treat bears with the correct respect. Where is that damn bear? I see it. Damn it. Come back here, you. Damn you. Huh. Oh, you. I can actually see its hit point bar. Gotcha. Oh, bloody tree. Got him. Got him. Right. Bloody bears. Um, so as I was saying, or trying to say, the uh, yeah, definitely lots of gold in this area. Um, time is an issue, and these kind of trips, the further you have to travel out, the harder the trips become, um, because you've got the travel travel time out. Um, and we took. You know, it didn't take. It wasn't that bad for me uh, on this particular trip, but um, going back, that's going to be a, a lot more of a of an issue. Um, going to take a lot more time in terms of real time, and of course, you know, real time is a very precious commodity to me because I only have a certain amount more with work and all of the other good things. So, consequently, I'm beginning to think that using the the home command might be useful. Now, what I don't want to do is start using it as a practical alternative to travel. Um, as, a, as, a, as travel everywhere, because I just think it it makes a mockery of, of some of the intentions. And obviously it was included realistically on this f um, as part of a server pack. Or at least I believe it was. Um, I don't think it was ever intended to be left in. Uh, that's my, my personal thoughts on it. But at this later stage... Ooh, rich. B. Surface gold. 35. Now again, I, I, oh, I didn't record it out. Surface gold. 35. Now, as I say, I don't want to get into the idea of teleporting everywhere. Um, I don't mind it on other games, This, but this is Terra Firmacraft. One of the points of Terra Firmacraft is supposed to be harder. But I also do recognise the kind of the trade-off uh, against time so I'm going to use the back command to return from this journey um, because I can not because I think it's in any way accurate or a, a good use of the command I just think you know because I can I'm going to pistachio don't want it um, let me know oh red apple do want it Okay, let me know what you think about that. Um, as I say, I, it's for me, it is primarily and mainly just because we need to, I need to make effective use of time. Um, a time which is obviously for me a increasingly 
rare commodity, ah, bismuth. So, yeah, right, we are going to continue on. I'm going to stop waffling for a bit because I need to have a little bit of a search around, see if I can't find any iron. We've definitely found winter territory, though. And uh, night time is falling, so that is a thing to do. But we're getting nice and far away. And uh, we'll see We'll see how we go, but uh, I'll be back in a moment. All right, we've come more or less full circle back roughly back to where we have well you'll see in a moment we just scan this not scanned a lot of these because obviously things so this was where we found the well the surface copper the surface oh god a surface business surface gold um just lots and lots of surface exposed surface ores up there. None of it actually what we want. You know, it's just, just pointing out that's where we are. And if we head over this way, uh, Bismuth Trace there potentially, um, what we want to do is avoid that. Sp well, let's have a look how hard that spider tree is going to be to deal with, shall we? Um, because if we can get in and hack out the, uh, I suppose we can have a go. Nope. Got it. Ender pearls will definitely take juniper berries. We'll take those from there. I'll take that. I'll, yeah. Right. Because we've dealt with that, I don't have to worry about it so much being in the area. This is the only reason I wanted it out of the way. And also, it's they're really good sources of ender pearls. Um, so somewhere around here, there was some iron trace. So I thought rather than faff around trying to find more, here we go, we've definitely found our iron trace, so let me pop this down. Now you can see my problem here is, this is all full. <laughs> yeah, that was uh, oversight on my part. I thought I'd emptied it, obviously I hadn't. Um, Potion of slowness. Why the hell I'd want that? I don't know. I suppose I can. I can always um, scan them. If nothing else, I'm getting points for them. Uh, I don't know whether you get anything from that. No. Uh, huh. I think everything else we we kind of scanned. So we've got that. We don't really have a huge amount of space going on in here, so we'll uh, we'll we'll keep those. I've got no idea whether they're any good for anything, but disc uh, gunpowder, no. Yeah. Uh, right. We'll seal you back up. That is obviously useless to us. It is dead to me. As the say, as the old thing goes, it's it's useless. Uh, we don't really need that. We certainly don't need those. We certainly don't need those. So bye bye to those. And if I come and grab you, we should have a pro pick in here. And what we are looking for, this is a basalt rock. So somewhere around here, there should well, potentially. could be some hematite but it is not being very forthcoming so let me check the uh, or diction the uh, wiki and uh, find out where this spawns because the odds are it's just low down we'll go and find it and hopefully it'll be a reasonable quality I shall be back in a mo right we uh it's definitely basalt layer it applies appears at all layers and uh, if we search around here we found i just roughly found the middle of the distribution of the um of the ore samples and then 
very large sample, getting closer. So we're within, I think it's about 12 blocks, give or take. Very large sample. Let me just stab one of these here for the time being. So there we go. And it's standard quality, which is absolutely fine. I can work with that. Um, found hematite. Yay! Right. So, armed with that, we can now try and work out where the hell the vein is, but we've got we've definitely got hematite. Uh, I'm definitely going to need to work out how the hell I'm going to do this. Ah. Um, mm, 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 oh, I didn't bring... Oh, damn you. Right. We'll just go up here and... Oh, interesting. That is really bizarre behaviour, but we'll, we'll fix it. Um, right, we definitely need, therefore, we're going to need to... Well, we need several things. But we're going to need a chisel and a hammer for starters. And... Uh, We'll, we'll deal with that for the f time being. Hmm. I wonder whether I can actually land on the top of that. I can. So can I then take out these ladders and place them on the side? That would kind of make sense, wouldn't it? Uh, like a so, then we can take those out and get that down like that. So armed with a chisel, now at least I've got the means of um, creating some support uh, above. Yeah, I don't really want it there. I want it one higher up, but. Let's um, let's see what we can do, shall we? Uh, we need that and that. <sighs> ah, there we go. We'll we'll come down one. That will instead of going up, we'll come down. That makes a lot of sense, doesn't it? Yes, it does. Well done, right, um, we shall stick that there, we shall come in here and there and pop that there, we'll come in there, we'll have that out there and there, get that in there, that should give us a little bit of wiggle room and uh, we should be able to actually now do some, some work down here, well, in theory. Not entirely sure which way this vein of stone of uh, hematite is going though, so that's going to be uh, fairly important, I think, to kind of work out uh, because that's kind of heading off this kind of direction. I don't know whether it's heading this way or what. Er, we need to kind of sort ourselves out a wee bit here, I think. So, yeah. Let me get myself situated. We're going to work down here, and uh, again, I shall be back in a moment. Well, <coughs> waiting for the daytime so I can go back up and get some, uh, uh, make a water barrel, but we have definitely definitely found the hematite. Uh, I've had, had some cave-ins, um, some very good cave-ins actually. Uh, <laughs> this place is definitely prone to a good cave-in or two. Um, didn't get killed obviously, which is, you know, what matters. But um, yeah, 
complacency is a big big killer in terra firma craft i've said it before i'll say it again you get overconfident and this game will bite you quite literally and spit you right out uh right so in theory i should be able to take that out and then we can come in down here i'm not worrying too much about these blocks i'm just kind of working wherever necessary above now you can see this hematite above there um and we will worry about that later because that is not supported up there um i can go in here quite happily um but i can't mine this lot without the risk of destroying some of this lot and there is a lot of this lot so yeah we're playing it slow i think is the uh, slow and steady that's the answer to this particular thing because there's so much of it and it's good quality well you know normal quality and uh what i don't want is to go dropping any more ores or rocks into the into the mix so to speak because that would be bad that's a trademarkable phrase bad trademark um however we need, do need we, we do need to go and get water um we've got this is reasonably well lit actually down here we've got and not a an, an un, untrivial amount of storage for this so i'm not going to get too stressed <coughs> If you're part of my uh, little explosion there um but i would like to take this stuff back with me so i'm kind of in in two minds at the moment how to handle this now i've got some wood so we can make a uh i only needed one really didn't i doesn't matter um we can always place those in there and we'll head up and uh, just get some water to bring down here and work with we can set ourselves up with a food table and stuff down there i can mine out a whole load of iron um and i can also check how long i've been going for so i will be back with you in a sec all right it's an official this is a stopover point <laughs> um yeah the amount of mineral here is absolutely ludicrous so we are going to be stopping here and uh, i'm going to just get rid of a little bit of this junk down there i don't think i want half of this this stuff i'm i'm intrigued with keeping i think the cobble i'm going to let go and uh i probably pop the ladder away. I'll uh, keep hold of these, but drop. Hello, I don't know. It's difficult sometimes, but yeah, we need to make some food. Uh, we are running close to time, but about, yeah, probably about 28, 30 minutes. So this is probably as good a time to break as any and what i will do is between episodes i will mine a whole load of iron um and then we can try the the stuff of the teleportation um do let me know what you think about the use of the back and potentially the home function and now i know people have said the backs fire you know I've, I've mentioned this before and everybody's been fine with it but and certainly the the line that most people seem to favor is if it's in the get if it's in the pack use it uh and you know quite frankly i i can go with that i can live with it if it's in the pack you, you, you use it that's absolutely fine um but i don't want to be relying on it as a, as a transport mode i think you know i think as a 
as a means of time saving, getting back after an expedition such as this, potentially even fixing a a slight error in you know my in judgment where you know I've come out and not emptied all of my barrels. That could have been a you know a semi legitimate because it, it is a cock up after after all. And it's only a game, I suppose. That's the the other thing we do have to remember. You know, it's at the end of the day we're playing this for enjoyment, and and if at the end of a session I am facing many hours of just literally walking back to my base, well, that kind of seems almost you know silly to. To go to those lengths if there's a quick alternative so yeah let me know what you think um, I'm always open um, unfortunately because I am pre-recording for my holiday here I will probably have made a rough decision but um, before you've had a chance to respond because you know this uh, if all goes as planned, and I'm still working out trying to get my content pre-recorded, so hopefully I will have everything that I want. But you know what it's like. Time, time, and you know things things crop up to to muck around with your schedule, and uh, and no doubt, and I'm no different to anybody else. You know, real life has a bad habit of cropping up and, and biting you on the ass. So. Um, Hopefully this will be the first day that I'm actually away uh, at the point you're watching this and there'll be at least one, maybe two more episodes of Terra Firma Craft out before I get back. So, yeah, um, I will probably work with it and we'll see how we go. But anyway, till next time, thank you very much for watching, guys, and I will see you soon. Bye for now.